Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. You may notice something funny in our schedule. It looks like we may have played the first game of the NBA season to the 76ers and lost. Now you might go, huh, I must have missed that episode. Let me go back and check the video feed. When you'll realize that no, you're not mistaken. Um, my whole I don't I don't know how to explain it. My audio just crapped itself and went robot voice. Just I'll show you right here. Low game strong. Let's go. To Isaiah Joe from the long range. Going back to Patrick Williams though. To Corey Kisper play. What a screen from the rookie splash. Get this man a retirement home. That's Austin Rivers. Uh, no rhyme, no reason, no explanation. So all the good work and fun moments that we would have had are lost to the void because of technical difficulties. And I can't tell you of anything more infuriating than that. So what we're going to do is pretend like this never happened. The game one loss debut of the NBA season did not happen to the 76ers, but rather we are going to be taking on the Orlando Magic. As far as the game is concerned, nothing notable happened other than Derek Jones Jr. was the greatest player in the history of basketball and Joel Embiid was a monster. As for us, we were largely disappointing. And I think one of the big things that we're going to have to do is really build the team around LaMelo Ball. <coughs> now, first things first, uh, ooh, we have an upgrade. We got an upgrade. You know what? I'm in on this and I want to improve our scouting. Let's go. Oh, all right. Upgrades complete. Wasn't that fun? Pew, 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 pew. We're playing an RPG. Next up is everybody's favorite bit. Let's run through some of your comments. Professor Airball reading through your comments. From CFP Fanatic, the mellow to Durin Lob is going to be crazy. This team should be a playoff contender. Great moves minus the draft, but Childers should be a random hidden gem. First of all, excuse me, it's not my fault that the only player that we wanted in the draft went number one overall, and then I just couldn't justify trading up to number five overall. I would have traded, I swear to you, if uh, Lester, whatever, Mo went number six or fell to number six, I would have traded up. I just couldn't justify trading into the top five as well as getting LaMelo Ball on our team in the same offseason. So this upcoming draft, we're going to have a lot more players scouted. A lot better understanding of who's going to be available to us, but appreciate that. Next comment is Christina McConnell. Wow, you traded everything to get LaMelo Ball. I'm a big fan of that. Kudos. I'm a big fan of that kid. Super talented and awesome in the game, but I really don't see it working out with your play style. Excuse me. Rude. You better start to learning how to score in the paint with the PG floaters, law, flashy passes. So whatever player catches the ball. The, for the words, I don't know. I love the move. I hope it works. I picture you getting really well-rounded team that can shoot the three, but I love flashy paint dominance on offense. Defense still mind-blowing. Epic. Appreciate that. And yeah, we got float game strong. Don't forget. I'm going to learn how to play 2K. That's the whole point of this is that we're going to get good at the game. Look at that beautiful green release. Float game strong with the manual quickly. Float game strong with a mellow ball. We're going to be alley-ooping it to Jalen Duran every single possession. We're going to be just dominating this game. Now, the thing about the move is that we haven't, we've been building like really well-balanced teams, but we haven't gotten superstar top heavy. And I feel like LaMelo Ball and Scotty Barnes is the ability to get just a ridiculously top heavy team that's going to be better than, better than most players expect. So anyway, next up is from Mr. Ball 33 Feel like you should get rid of Gary and Bruce and get a starting caliber shooting guard to start ahead of Dick. Dick will turn into about an 81 to 83 overall, so good enough for a backup. Yeah, Dick obviously isn't going anywhere. We need Dick all day, every day. The rest of the guys, uh, Isaiah Joe and Bruce, uh, Gary Trent Jr. are kind of the same players, so I'm not really sure what we're going to do with that at this point. I'm just kind of like in stasis mode. I'm I'm on pause. They're obviously an upgradable position. I mean, let me... Let's, 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 We'll look at the roster real quick. I mean, point guard, we're set. DeLon Wright is a perfectly serviceable point guard three. Emmanuel quickly is going to moonlight as a two, as well as a backup. Lamella Ball. Gary Trent Jr., Isaiah Joe, kind of the same player. If we could trade them for like a Jalen Brown at some point or get somebody of that caliber of a wing, we'd be good. RJ Barrett's going to be good enough. He'll probably get high 80s, maybe low 90s when he reaches his prime. Patrick Williams, I don't know. Agbaji. He's a little old, so he might be on the outside looking in, but I still want to try to develop him. And then, of course, we have Malik Elliott. Hopefully, two, three years down the road, he'll be a good backup. Scott Barnes is great. Jalen Duran, Chris Boucher, Cecil Childress. And you know what? You're right. Let's drop Chris Boucher to power forward for now. It's not going to be a big difference, but he's just a great, versatile guy. And he played so well for us last season in the few stretches that he had that he's still on the team. And that's all it takes for me 
as the GM is to say, are you good when we play? Yes, you're still in. Next up, Christina McConnell again. I would set the sliders to put your offensive consistency up by five and offensive awareness up by five. Uh, I'm not going to do that yet, but I did update the close shot success sliders because we keep missing like really easy baskets way too often. So done with that. Goodbye. Your boy 774046. What editing app to use? I use the DaVinci Resolve. It's free for Mac. Next up from Too Fast for You. When driving to the basket, you should do a scoop Euro step layup. It's so much better than holding the shoot button. And to touch up the alley-oop recommendation, players like Kenny Martin Jr. and Jaren Jackson Hayes are perfect for it. Yeah, man. I'm uh, 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 uh. I do the Euro. Like, I'm all in on the Euro and the spinning layup. Okay, you didn't even do it there. It just, sometimes it doesn't trigger. Like, I'm holding it, and I want to, it's it, okay, not triggering. I don't know how to do the scoop. There's my spin. There's my spin from LaMelo Ball. So, the spin is if you hold down the turbo button and then double tap the square button. Wow, he just decided to dunk it. That's the little mellow ball experience. Uh, that's when the player will spin right here. There we go. Oh, he's just dunking it now. And then if you don't hold the turbo, he should do the Euro. It just, sometimes it doesn't work. And there's there's not a lot I can do when the players refuse to do the things that I'm telling to <laughs> with the buttons that I'm pressing. I don't, you know, you know what I'm saying? Daniel, is your name Daniel Cuck 69 I love it. Ye same, love the channel. People like Rusty never finish the series, so here's a new sub. I appreciate that. We're going to finish every single series because we're here. We're in it to win it, baby. And lastly, from Emiliano, by the way, for Raptors franchise, if you change your shot meter, it should help. The thing is, I haven't changed the shot meter because uh, I'm bad. I mean, I kind of like the, the, the straight. The comment looks okay. I just feel like... I, it's tough to read when the meter is small, like when's the right time to hit the release, but we could try Comet for a bit. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, Comet it is. Oh, I missed. How does this work? Oh, that's the elevator screen that they normally run for clay. Yeah, I'm in on that. We'll add that play to the playbook. And it's time for us to debut, even though we did already play, but this is our home debut. The Toronto Raptors, the LaMelo Ball debut game, because the last game didn't get recorded properly. You know what? I'm actually hoping that this one's audio got recorded properly, too. I'm actually, I'm actually worried. And also, yes, uh, I am still dealing with the sickness that I had during the offseason. If you want to blame some of my more peculiar offseason moves on being sick, be my guest. <laughs> Okay, I think the defensive made changes are made. Oof, I'm not feeling great. But anyway, there's a few things. Oh, we won the tip. Jalen Duran won the tip. Let's go. They got James Harden. And the first play of the game is going to be the Jalen Duran lob. Throws it down. LaMelo ball. Money. And let's play some defense. All right. So I feel like, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, I feel like Jalen Suggs just bullied LaMelo Ball, then missed. Jalen Duran grabs the rebound. We got numbers. We got Scotty Barnes. Kick it. Corner. Gary. Oh. Oh. I don't know about that. Yeah, I got a little three happy. I get that. I get a little excited when we're in transition. I get a little excited playing basketball. I'm sorry about that. I can't apologize. Oh. I do want to make sure that we keep the flow game strong. And LaMelo Ball, ooh, he uh, makes it. We have a two-point lead. The Scott Barnes LaMelo Ball connection already looking money. LaMelo Ball fitting right in. First points, first assist. Franz Wagner screening. Oh, I'm there. Great contest from RJ. And he's leaking. RJ Barrett. Pump and go around. Pump and go around. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. But we got a 6-2 lead. Let's go. The big three, RJ Barrett, LaMelo Ball, Scott Barnes. Are we working right now? Oh, look at this defense. Shane Lederen flies in for the rebound. We got a strong rebounder. We got a strong team. We got RJ Barrett back door. Lost the ball. RJ Barrett stinks. Damn it, RJ. Uh, this is the Corey Kispert play. It does not work at all. And for some reason, Scott Barnes is going to take an open three. Bang. Horrible release. And look at this. Look at this. We're debuting. If this isn't a playoff team, I don't know what is. 
Oh, my defense is so bad. In screen. James Harden's wide open. Scott Barnes says he's not going to make two in a row, right? Oh, perfect release. Splash. I promise you, the only thing that we changed was the shot meter. I didn't update anything with our with our with our with our three point shot. What was that? I don't know, but they are playing horrific offense, and RJ Barrett's open, pulling up. Oh, <laughs> I got too excited. Wow, Paulo's fast. Okay, it's four to twelve. That's a really oh my, oh my, oh my. Look at James Harden getting a little filthy with it. Uh, are we got this? We got this! Throw it down, Scotty! He doesn't dunk it, but you know what? We have a 10-point lead. Are we about to blow out the magic in our debut game with this new roster? Jalen, Duran, LaMelo, Ball, even Patrick Williams? This is going to be a heck of a season. I hope you guys are excited because I'm hyped and we just... I don't know how to stop giving up easy dunks to the rolling center because 2k doesn't know oh, uh, just like well, why is that such an you know what? whatever whatever i'm not even mad i would like to be able to call my own plays though at some point that would be fun because scotty barnes isn't a catch and shoot three point shooter oh perfect well <laughs> i want the scotty barnes screen roll he gets blocked pathetically and someone's open. It's Gary in the corner. Bang. Gary Tread Jr. You know, offensively, we are dynamic. Defensively, I don't love it. Jalen Duran's about an average. Wow. Oh, my gosh. James Harden stinks. Throw it up to the big fella. Oh, he got bombed. Oh no, James Harden's played defense. Okay. Well, we're having a, an incredibly dynamic first quarter for us, which is wonderful. Uh, my problem is when I don't get the bump animation, it looks funny, but here we go. Playing defense against the Franz. He's fading. He's missing. Wendell's right there though. Jalen Suggs, nobody stopped him. Okay. You know, I was entranced. By this lob city magic. The lob! Jalen Duran throws it down! And the lob is gonna be unstoppable. Are we a dynamic offense? Is this team good? Is Dick trying to guard Banchero? Ooh, that's not good. Paulo Banchero. Uh oh, I don't know if Dick can guard Banchero. Oh my gosh, Anthony Black just throws it down over our team. And that miraculous first quarter is starting to come a little unhinged here. Okay, though, run some offense for me, 2K. Oh, LaMelo back door! LaMelo! Put that man in a poster! Wow, who did he yam it over? Is that Banchero? Number one overall pick. Yes, I know I'm saying Paula Bencaro's name wrong. It just, you know, I think it's a little funny to call him Banjaro as he splashes in my face. He just got revenge. He said, y'all go dunk on me. I go splash on you. Oh, we got him. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, here's, it's the elevator screen. Is this for Dick? What is happening? Dick sets an illegal, Dick, you can't do that. <laughs> boom, boom. Wow. Wow, Cecil Childers just got blew right by. The rookie can't play defense, and it's now a two-point game. Let's see what we got. Let's get the rookie going in some... Oh, I'm taking it. I'm taking it. LaMelo ball too fast. Going to the free throw line. Oh, man, like my whole chest is congested. Anyway, Dick on, Va Dick on Franz. Dick on Franz. Where's the foul? The rookie comes in unnecessarily, doesn't do anything. Come on, Cecil. Let's get the rookie going in. Oh, I'm lobbing it. I'm lobbing it! The unstoppable lob. LaMelo ball to the rookie. Franz Wagner tries to block it and he can't. Cecil Childers fitting right in. A true seven footer. I think Jalen Duran's only 6'10". Oh, IQ. 
just got moved. Cole Anthony said anything you can do, I can do better. Dick screaming open. Dick for three. Perfect release. Splash. And Dick can't miss. Grady Dick cashes in. And Lamella Ball gets moved. Oh, Cecil. You got to work on that fouling problem. Franz, five, four. Wow, Franz just pulls up, misses. Three, two. Cecil Childress, full court, misses. And uh, a really high scoring first quarter, 27 to 26. Take it. Be honest with y'all, I don't know how long my voice is going to last. Uh, I did the full hour recording yesterday and my voice was gone by quarter three. The fact that it's already going and we're still in the first quarter is a little rough. Look at Scotty B playing the D. And here we go. Flow came strong. Oh. Let's get Scotty the ball. And run the reverse IQ pick and roll fade. There we go. What a legendary screen. We're getting doubled. Somebody get some better ball movement. Throw it down. Scotty B over Precious Achua. That defensive effort was precious, but we yammed it on him. Oh, this team is fun right now. We're having a we're having a grand old time. Uh oh, you know, respectfully, that was good enough defense for not getting any bump animation. So here we go, Gary. Gear. Oh my gosh, did you see how quickly that timer went? I swear, sometimes it goes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sometimes it goes slow. Wow, lose the ball. Lose the ball. Get the ball. Steal the ball. Be the ball. Oh. It's actually for RJ. RJ? Oh my gosh, your release, sir. What is that? Why is your release so quick? You guys see that I'm better at releases, but it's just like... When they inexplicably make it incredibly fast, yeah, I'm gonna have trouble. Like, duh. Cole Anthony wide open. I don't know how I'm supposed to play defense on that. I got screened like 17 times. I think we need a timeout. Okay, struggling here in the second quarter. That's to be expected after coming out so extremely hot in the first. Uh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let's go run the break. Who we got? We got RJ. He's gonna pump. He's gonna lamella ball back door. Lamello ball throws it down and Lamello is having himself a game. Cole Anthony with the foul. You kidding me? You kidding me? Look at this foul. How is this not an and one? <laughs> How is this not an and one? He's inside of me, coach. <laughs> How is this not an and one? <laughs> Can we just look at this? <laughs> How is this not an and <laughs> it's like some horror show stuff. This is what freaking Pablo Picasso paints. <laughs> <laughs> okay let's get into it it's got a good closely contested game here i like that i love that i want some more of that Paulo gets the handoff we're still playing defense i'm still getting the bump they switch me inexplicably don't know why baby that's that was not a good shot i don't know why he took that Lamelo cross lamello 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 Oh, look at that. Long two, RJ Barrett leaking. RJ, throw it down! Tie ball game. The RJ Barrett dunk. Can't be stopped. In transition, we're the best player in the history of 2K. All right, now we just got to play a little defense here. Don't let them get anything easy. Nothing cheap. Jalen Suggs fading three. I'll take that. Oh, Paulo Bancaro's right there. And Scotty doesn't even try to play defense. I do like his mismatch, though. Jalen Duran. Flow came strong? Well, I mean, <laughs> not really. I won't lie. I completely forgot that Jalen Duran has the Jacoberto free throw yips. We just went two for two with that man. That's, that's how good we are today. We're on point. We're electric. We're dynamic. We can't be stopped. Gary, 
Incredible defense, Gary. That's how you stop the screen and roll, Gary. That's how you play defense. Move your feet, son. Three, two. Oh my gosh. He just turboed to the left and I went to the right and that was it. It's okay. It's all right. Uh, let's let's do a little uh, do a little Jalen Duran magic. Do a little Jalen Duran magic. Throws it down. Our best play is the Jalen Duran alley. Oop. I'm starting to feel like Trey Young out here, in that I'm short and can't play defense. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. There we go. Running. We got numbers. We got Jalen Duran. Jalen Duran! Kick it! Gary! Oh, stop reaching! Uh, okay, so... Uh, <laughs> Dick Harden? Really? <laughs> Sometimes you just can't make this stuff up like Patrick Williams playing defense. It, it's just impossible. It doesn't happen. I don't know why our defense is so porous today. Anyway, Dick Ball and Harden Ball is uh, together. It's just the, the, the jokes write themselves. Lamella Ball? Oh god. That was not what I wanted. Oh god. Oh god. Ochai oh, Agbaji missed. Oh! Ochai! Oh, for three! This is going to be a big development year for Ochai oh, Agbaji. Some of the players that are that probably are on the outside looking in is going to be Ochai. Oh, oh wow, Lamella. You just you can't move your feet at all. Alright, currently rocking the dick ball backcourt. Uh, Ochai is going to be on the outside looking in. Dick for three. Bang! Dick bang from ball. Oh, come on. Come on, the rookie. Cecil Childress, play defense. Get the rebound. Don't let nothing easy in. Oh, oh no. That was some BS. Anyway, Gary Trent Jr., Isaiah Joe, Ochai Baji, all going to be concerned Cecil Childress needs to show me that he can play Dick always gonna be on the team you kidding me Dick misses what how do you miss with Dick I don't like that they're playing Ochai here I don't know why Patrick Williams can't play defense I don't know what's happening this play is weird and they just get a backdoor James Harden and one are you kidding me We'll say the rookie center has not been great. Oh my gosh, that release. It doesn't matter. Splash! Emmanuel, quickly! 4-3! Ryman accidentally! Splash of their own, damn it. I think I got half a voice left. Ooh, Patrick Williams. Bona fide three-point shooter. I keep was open. I keep passing to the track. I'm sorry. All right. Dick fade. Let's go. Dick to P will. Who P won't? Nope. That's fine. Oh, no. Oh, no. Draw the foul. Oh, look at that defense from Isaiah Joe. And we got a oop to Emmanuel quickly. Oh, my gosh. He's flexing on him. IQ goes up in the air and throws it down. What a way to close out the half. We are just alley-oop spamming right now. And you know what? I'm loving every moment of it. Patrick Williams on Paula Bancaro. Heck of a matchup. Locks him down. Full court heave. Oh. And this is a heck of a game. Hey, looking at the halftime stats. Scotty Barnes is having a strong game. 12-2-1. 4, 7, 2, 3 shooting. Jalen Duran, 8 and 9. Really impressive for him. Defensively, not great. I kind of like to see a block or two on his stat sheet. Lamelo Ball has just been sensational for us. Dick has been good. IQ with an alley oop. RJ Barrett's been good, especially defensively. RJ's been strong for us. Gary's been whatever. Ochai's been whatever. The rookie, I'm undecided so far. Isaiah Joe's been bad. Patrick Williams has been bad. As for them, Apollo. Paolo Benchero has been all right, 13, 6, and 4. Jalen Suggs has been pretty good. Franz has been okay. Cole Anthony's been okay. James Harden's been bad. And that's kind of the difference between, uh, I guess, them playing better and uh, where we are now. You know what? Here we go. Here we go. Play defense. RJ Barrett. I got... He just went right around me. Oh, Jalen Duran, just, just block that. 
Um, let's see, what kind of place should we run here? Again, going to Scotty B, the elevator screen. I don't love it. I mean, we drew a foul out of it, whatever. Oh, wrong guy. Oh, go the up and under. Whoop, 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 whoop. Scotty, no. Oh, I thought we were salty with that. I thought we were a little spicy. Yeah, I just completely did not guard. But that one's on me. All right, boys, let's lock in. Let's get good. Like we know we should. Let's get... Oh, Jalen Duran up in the air. Wow. Cocks it back, throws it down. Now look, offensively, we're fine. This is the end where we need to lock in. So let's lock the F in, boys. Wow, what a screen. What a screen, what a non-help from Scotty B. He just did nothing but stare at his ball and went, Wow! If it ain't broke, don't fix it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it! Jalen Duran, go into the free throw line, and here we go. The Jalen Duran free throw hour. <sighs> All right. Ah. Oh. Okay. Breathe. <sighs> oh. <laughs> I'm there. I'm there. I'm there. Why did my guy move? I was pressing the move closer to the ball. Thumbstick. And he was just like, no, let me give him some space. Underneath the basket. Jeez, game. Scotty B, hit this three. Wow. If it's any consolation, I am playing this through a capture card. So like, I think my input to reaction timing is not like down to the millisecond. I don't know if that counts at all, but like, oh my God. Just the, the screen of roll is impossible. That's, that's my reason for why I'm being sh** at this game. All right, does that help? No, it doesn't. <laughs> oh no. Defense, defense. Oh my gosh, he just turboed around me. Yeah, that's fair. RJ versus Franz, RJ versus the Franz. RJ plays the D. Let's go RJ. Now what we got? Now what we got? We got an open Lamello. Oh, RJ sprints and he wants his three. He wants his green. Splash, RJ Barry. All right, now we just have to get a stop. We have to stay in front of our man. We have to play good lockdown defense. Scotty B gets screened twice. I mean, that's crap. I, I maneuver the screen perfectly, but he's still screening. And then Wendell Carter Jr. makes it over Jalen Duran like that. Oh, jeez. Oh, Scotty, just play some defense. Scotty, come on. I think what we need to do is run our run our lethal point guard screen and just let Scotty B go to the free throw line. Cuz uh whatever offense we're running right now, I mean honestly the offense isn't a problem. It's my freaking defense that I can't I can't do anything to stop them. Pull your boxers up over your belly buttons. It's time to lock in, boys. Let's go. Screen, Jalen Suggs go under. He can't shoot. Oh my god. Just I can't I can't do anything if that's if that's how they score. Oh, oh, oh! Give it to the center. Why why are their passes allowed to go and mine aren't? How is that? Uh, that's 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 not a foul. That's not a foul. Darko Rajanovic is pissed. The ruling on the floor stands. Oh, blow me. What is happening? How is that a blocking foul? I was in the air to rebound the ball! 2K, you suck! Oh, I don't know what this, like, update is that they just put in, but my god, the fouls are stupid. Okay. Just lock in. That's all. Who am I guarding? Why do you keep switching me onto somebody who's not involved in the play? Fuck, that was like an eight point swing right there. 
Jesus Christ, dude. All right, RJ. Hit this three, baby. Splash. Timing. Very late. Doesn't matter. Lead is down to nine. All right. Time to tie the strings on your boxers. Lock in, baby. Lock in. Three in the key. Three in the key. What is happening? Oh my god, why is Paulo Bancaro wide open for three splash? Why? 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 Um, I I'm feeling a flow game strong here. If I can just be completely honest with you. Flow game strong? That wasn't a floater. That was a jump shot. That's why my timing was so bad. Is because that wasn't a floater. That was a jump shot. Flow game strong. More like your mom's thong. Oh, let's go! Charging foul! Paolo Banchero! Oh, they're in the penalty? I'm about to abuse them. I'm about to abuse them. Let's go, flow game strong. Flow game strong! Emmanuel quickly! Let's go. Your boy's learning. I'm a neural net processor, a learning computer. Dick on Banchero. Yeah, that's just, there's no chance. It's fine, pressures that you can't shoot. <laughs> He's like a 20 something percent free throw shooter. Patrick Williams tips it in from the rookie. Oh my gosh, the center throwing alley oops. <laughs> what a little, what a tip. Oh, the lead is down to 10. Let's play some defense. I don't know why my team is playing so small and I, 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 if, if they're literally animating through me, if they're grabbing the ball through Dick, like, look, Paulo, <laughs> if he's bringing the ball through Dick, then I can't, oh my God, he just, like, I can't do anything if this is what, I, I, I'm speechless. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. Cecil Childress, the rookie. And we're playing. We're playing all right. They just we can't stop them at all on this end. Their offensive execution has been immaculate. I'm there, I'm doubling. I'm doubling. I'm doubling. I'm doubling. Let's go. Three in the key. Explanation: Jalen Suggs contested three corner miss. Oof. Yeah, they're shooting lights out right now. And I wish I could make the defensive switches to put in Chris Boucher to guard Paulo Banchero. But I don't have a high enough relationship with my head coach. So instead, he's going to put on a six foot six guard for Paulo Banchero. That's, that's smart. Okay. We may be down in the score, but we're not down in spirit. A Lamelo ball, Jalen Duran. Screen, he, he he rolled way too slow. Okay, we may be down in score, but we may, may not be down in spirit. <laughs> we, we, we've, we've been pretty pathetic. RJ Barrett's open for three, perfect release, and he misses because I'm two feet behind the three-point line. Okay then, 2K, do whatever you want to do and I will lose. I really don't mind this. Like, with all due respects to Mo Wagner, who's a fine NBA player. Wow, pass it to Jalen Duran. Oh my gosh. Okay. 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 There we go, baby. There we go, baby. Don't shoot it like a like a jump shot. Throw it down. Why do I have to tell you to dunk it? What is happening? Why was that to Gary Trent Jr.? Am I drunk right now? Is is my team falling apart before my very eyes? What in the hell is happening? RJ, you gotta make it. Come on, I know your feet weren't set. Come on, that wasn't a very late release. Come on, 2K. Oh, let me just play like mediocre. Oh, Cole Anthony. How does he get the rebound? There is all three of us. How does he get this rebound? 
Jalen Duran, LaMelo Ball, Gary Trent Jr., R.J. Barrett, Scotty Barnes, all around him, and it goes to Cole Anthony. That's how we lose right there. We were in a good competitive game, and then my team simply fell apart, decided that they couldn't make jump shots anymore, decided that they couldn't make layups anymore, and then we lose. LaMelo Ball doesn't run the back door correctly. Good stuff. Just good stuff, man. That wasn't a roll. Does, does nobody understand how to roll in this game? What is happening to my stupid team of stupid idiots who don't know how to play basketball? If I say stand here, you know what you don't do? It's stand somewhere else. You stand where I tell you to. When I tell you to roll, you know what you do? You roll. You don't just do 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 like I'm a puppy who's never heard the word English before. The worst part is we're not even out of this yet. It's just like we're so bad at everything. Like, we get two, three possessions in a row of getting stops and then actually playing smart. We're right back in it, but like, I don't know what happened. My team's IQ just dropped by 70 points after they watched the halftime show. There were strippers, all the blood went to their groin, and now they're like, I don't know what to do anymore. James Harden wide open for three splash. Why? Why? Why were you open, sir? What what sort of incredible off-ball movement did you execute here? He stood around and then he slightly moved over here. Gary for three splash. I appreciate the effort, Gary. I recognize that you've been pretty solid for us. I was I've been very critical of your game, your lack of upside. Ah, wow, what a screen. What a screen. And just Scotty didn't even put his hands up. He said, I'm going to look at you affectionately. I want to kiss you on the beard. I'm kind of losing hope of winning this one. We were in it for so long. And then just like the stupidity took over my team like a, like an infection. Wow, what a shot. What a shot, RJ Barrett. I'm just gonna take this right here. Oh, come on. Give me something, 2K. You can't, you just can't. Oh, wow. LaMelo Ball throws it off of, off of the bottom of the backboard, I guess? I don't even know what that was. Uh, I know Toronto's hyped right now. The game's over, guys. It's a 14-point deficit. Under three minutes remaining. They can't miss. What is happening? I didn't even run into that screen. What is ha- In what world was I even close to this screen? I was lightly shading, which I'm sick of. And then- Where are you going? What is- Let me just- Let me just leave the play. God almighty. Gary, gotta make it. Fuck you, dude. I, the screen and roll has to be stopped. I don't know what settings I need to change, but like, they just, they're not allowed to zip it right by my head. Like they're Patrick freaking Mahomes. We just, we have to figure out what rule needs to be enabled to stop that from happening. I don't care. Wow, we made that three. Anyway, another frustrating game. Um, We were really into it, but we just couldn't get a single stop at all. And I don't, I don't know what adjustments to take away from this besides that pick and roll cheese. Like what? What possibly could I have altered to, to tell my guys to hit their open shots with slightly late or slightly early releases, to tell my guys to play defense instead of giving up wide open backdoor cuts? Like what? Ah, uh, this was a frustrating loss, man. You can't give up 131 points a game. I'm gonna look up how to how to stop the backdoor cuts. Uh, Paulo Bencaro was incredible, 39, 12, and eight. Um, I'm gonna I'm just I'm, I'm done with this. We have to make our own coaching substitutions, so relationships, whatever it is, 
We're going to be making our own coaching, our own substitutions, our own decisions. I needed Paula Bencaire to be picked up by Chris Boucher, by Patrick Williams, by anybody not named freaking Grady Dick or Ochai Agbaji. That was just idiotic. Um, we need to be able to call our own plays. So that is going to be the one thing that I'm going to do is that I'm taking over the coaching duties. Darko Rajanovic, you're fired. You've done a horrible job. I'm going to look up some ways to limit. I guess I call it cheesy pick and roll wide open, not even back door, but they just zip it right by the defenders heads. Like they don't know how to play defense. We're going to cut that out and we're going to win the next game against the New York Knicks. All right. You heard it here first. The air ball Jones guarantee we're winning our next game. That's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.